So Emmy is doing her hair and Emmy thought I was eating a Swedish fish. So that reminded me of this story. <laughs> of the last time I ate Swedish fish. It was a very long time ago. So I went to youth group one day and they taught us about fasting. So the next day I thought, I'm gonna fast for the whole day. And I was fasting. I was doing a good job. And then someone offered me Swedish fish <laughs> and I was eating them without thinking about it. And then after like the sixth Swedish fish, Someone was like, we're gonna go get food now. What do you want, Sarah? And I was like, nothing, I'm fasting. And then I was like, <laughs> I'm eating Swedish fish. So I spit out the one that I had in my mouth and then I felt sick about it. I haven't had Swedish fish since. That's a great story, Sarah. Yeah, you thank know, you. it's not that... Thank you for sharing that with me. I it's... felt like I really needed to know that. You, thank do you. Do you want to tell me your Swedish fish story? Oh, one time? This was actually a goldfish story. Those are salty. You're salty. <laughs> <laughs> Just like a snack. So, it was a really long road trip, and it's kind of a boring story, but it was a really long road trip, and... Uh... My story was not boring. I was in the front seat with my mom and there's this really awesome song that came on on the radio and I was like, this is my jam. I have to dance to this song. Right. Oh, it was a Swedish fish. You I, don't, I it. think it was a Swedish fish. It wasn't a goldfish. That was a twist. Plot twist. Plot twist. Yes. So I thought it would be cool if I made the Swedish fish dance across the screen because mm -hmm. I was videoing this while it was dancing. Really? Until I um, made it swim off screen so it was like right here. And then I brought it back, and my mom ate no. it, and it was like <laughs> that's so funny. So then it came back, and half of it was gone. I pretended to eat it, so that kind of acted out the story. Perfect, and you didn't even know it, dude. No nice. one eats Swedish fish except you whenever you're fasting. No, listen, Sarah. it was an accident. And then from that day on, I always chewed gum while I was fasting. I'm listening. Okay. I'm listening. So if you chew gum, you're not going to accidentally eat food while you're chewing gum because no one eats food while they're chewing gum. So that way whenever I'm like, oh, food, I'm just kidding. And then I'll be like, I have gum, I'm fasting. Nice. Do you call it fasting gum? Do you have it in a special box and you put fasting on it? No. Fasting gum? Because no. that would be cool. A really long time ago. I used to fast a lot and <laughs> this was a long time ago. And <sighs> did I mention it was a long time ago? Yes. Okay, so I fasted for two days once mm -hmm. and I chewed gum and I did not drink and I did not eat. You didn't drink? I did not drink. You're supposed to well, drink. Well, this group forgot to tell me that. I thought, I'm fasting, I will oh not drink. Oh my goodness. So anyway, it was late at night and I was up because I couldn't sleep because I wasn't drinking or eating. That's horrible. And I was allowed to eat when it was midnight and it was like 11, so I was like waiting for it to be midnight. Oh my goodness. And then I started passing out and I thought I was gonna die. I thought I, I legit thought I was dying, I was like, well, okay, Dude, drink I'm some dead water. now. So anyway, like I was passing water? out and I thought, yes, but it was like magical Jesus was involved. <laughs> and you, Jesus, Jesus doesn't have magic. I was getting to a deep well, discussion. I'm just kidding, don't. Why does this always happen? Last night, she asked me, Emmy, if you had to give up eating or sleeping, which would it be? We got into this long discussion about why it would be practical. I'm gonna shorten this. Okay. If you didn't have to sleep, you'd have more time. But if you didn't have to eat, you would save a lot of money and time. have more time. But exactly. Not quite as but then we were talking time. about, hey, sleep, did you have, you have to, to eat? eat more? And then we were thinking, hey, did you have to eat? And then we got like back into the Garden of Eden. Did you have to eat? Yeah. If did eating you was to for eat pleasure? Did you fall? have to sleep? So did you have to sleep before we sinned? <laughs> so anyway, yeah, it was awesome. I thought I was gonna die. I was passing out. I was like so certain. I was just like whatever. So I just laid there for an hour thinking I was dying and then it was midnight and I ate a strawberry and it was the <laughs> most delicious, wonderful, wet, juicy, sweet. <laughs> wet? That's disgusting. Don't it was call a wet, wet strawberry. Call it, it was so delicious. And it was only so delicious because my mouth was dry and 
You want some water? I was. Yeah, but not out of that cup. And I was sick. I actually feel a lot better today. I'm still a little bit congested, but my headache. Congestion. Congested. Congestion. <laughs> but congested. I'm not headache anymore. I'm not headache anymore. It was a really, really bad headache yesterday. Like I felt. Oh, she had so much ibuprofen. So, I had three ibuprofen and two other pills, but I don't know what they were. It's just Your this mom head gave cold them that's going me. around though. I was the most recent one to have it, and I guess I didn't give it to anyone. Well, Esther keeps talking about her having allergies. I don't know if I got sick or if it's just allergies. I think she's in denial because I think maybe she got it from me. Or it's just allergies. That'll be likely. This whole trip has been kind this of This is an interesting conversation. Weird time wise. Like I am so forgot how time works. Because Ooh, let me show you my new drawing. <gasps> oh, hand me, hand me. Not he focused. likes his ribs. Alas. <laughs> Do you know how much sleep I've got? <laughs> and it did not feel good. <laughs> like a pink gun drop with eyes and hair. The paws of a cat. Sir, like, not put it in.